All right, what's good with y'all, man? Today we're going to be raking all the defensive operators for Rainbow. We did the attack operators. Now we got to do the defenders. But when I did the attack operators, the new season wasn't out. So for this one with the new operator, Malusi, she's going to be in here. So let's get into it. At number 28, we got Tachanka, the OG, man. Now we all know Tachanka, you know, there was times when he was overpowered. And now he's just... Yeah, not really uh, usable, but the assault rifle is not bad, but sentry gun is a uh, eh. Oh, and if before, if I didn't state, there's 28 defensive operators, if you obviously didn't notice, so the chunk is the worst. And at number 27, we got Warden. Now, his SMG is really good, you know, same thing as Valkyrie, but his ability, it's, eh, it's not really useful that much, and he's also, he was a once beat, so... He's gotten better, but not good enough, so, yeah. 26, we got Goyo. Now, as you can see, I don't even own Goyo. I don't think I plan on it. Uh, his shields, in my opinion, I just don't think they're useful at all. I think they actually harm the team, in my opinion. And SMG is really good, but I, just, I don't see a reason to use them. At 25, we got Oryx. Now, once again, as you can see, I do not own him either. Uh... I've just never seen someone really use his ability as an advantage to like killing people. Now I know it can, but playing ranked at the higher ranks, I don't see it doing anything. Once again, he does have a good gun though, but not enough. Now 24, we got Clash, probably the most annoying operator in the game, but without constant teamwork and you know working around things, using her solo, just going on your own. It's not really going to help a whole lot. You need a team around you that you can work with. And if you don't have that, there's no point in using her. But if you're playing like that, then she's she's going to be a lot lower on the list. But, yeah. 23, we got Castle now. I was going to actually have him higher on the list. But just because a lot of the people that play Castle are usually not very good at Rainbow. So it kind of puts a bad name on him. And because of that, this is why he's at 23. At 22, we got Alibi. Now, Alibi is actually really good uh, if you know how to use her. Her gun is very good. And if you know how to, like, kind of cheese with her, make yourself look like a dummy or something, she can actually be really good, but sometimes it ain't going to work. So, you know. 21, we got Smoke. Now, Smoke is actually really good. His his gases, they, they could come in pretty clutch at times when someone's trying to blow up garage, you try to stop that quick plant. It's just, I'm not a big fan of his uh, gun. I know he has a shotgun. I don't really like shotguns. It's my list, so that's what kind of hurts him. Not a big fan of the FMJ. So At 20, we got Frost. Now, I like Frost, but she's one of those situational kind of operators. Sometimes, you know, there's some areas where it's real nice to use her, and sometimes it's like there's no need for it. But her assault rifle is really nice, but she's another one of those situational kind of operators. 19, we got Malusi. A lot of people are going to argue with this one. I don't see the hype in her. Yeah, she's fast. She's got a really nice gun. But I just don't... I have never died because of her gadget. If anything, I've gotten kills because of it. I just... I don't see the hype in her, but she is good, but I don't see the hype. At 18, we got Mira. Now, Mira, is, she's a very situational operator, but in the situations where she's needed, it's a must to have her, and it changes everything once you do have her. So, if she wasn't so situated, because, you know, there's some areas where you just really don't need her, but very good operator when she is needed. At 17, we got Vigil. Now, Vigil has probably one of the, the best guns in the game. Uh, in my opinion, his ability just is, he's a very, really good roamer. I just don't think his ability is good at all you know he's sitting there trying to hide and it kind of tells you he's there with the whole thing and then, I don't know I just I've never been a big fan of his ability but he does have one of the best guns in the game 16 we got Maestro now obviously he no longer has his ACOG which really hurts him a lot still a very good operator now you can say he's situational and you can say he's not it's up to you I kind of consider him a situational kind of operator but some people wouldn't say that but what hurts me is that he loses that ACOG, even though I never used him. As you can see, I don't own him. So, 15, we got Rook. Now, you can not you can never go wrong with picking Rook, especially when you got Black Ice for him. But, 
he puts that out armor down and he automatically helps the team so even if it dies it's like he did his role he did his thing so you can never go wrong to pick a rook if you're a beginner or if you're a pro it's always good to have a rook on the team now 14 we got Kaede, Kaede, however you want to say his name I'm actually not a big fan of him just because I really don't like you know slower operators but he is good to have I'm not a fan of him but it is good to have him you know get those drop downs you know but like I said I'm not a fan of him but he is good to have now 13 we got Mozzie now this is where the operators I would say starting right here these are like top tier operators I would say where comp operators these are guys you want to have now Mozzie he's, he's a little debatable but all his guns are really good and it's always good to have a drone rolling around you know seeing what's going on so these are where the top tier operators start with 12 we got cap can I mean look he puts those trip wires down let's be honest we don't feel like looking we don't even see it half the time you know unless you're IQ but he's an annoying guy to go against he's got a good gun I just uh Never really used him, even though I got black eyes for him, but he's one of those annoying guys to go against. Now at 11, we got Valkyrie. Now we all know Valkyrie, she got, she, she'll got she get that one cheesy camera up. You don't know where it's at. You can't find it, and it just changes the whole game. I mean, she could have intel on you, and you don't even know it. And that could just change the whole game, which is why she's a top-tier operator. All right, so now we're getting into the top 10. At number 10, we got Kavera. Now... I'm not a big fan of her guns. I never really liked them, but she does have one of the best abilities in the game where she can literally go completely silent. So stick for attack. You got to pick one. You can move a complete silence with bad guns or, you know, so, which is really annoying going, going against that dead silence. So that's why she in that top 10. At number nine, we got Pulse. Now we all go against some of those real comp pulses. You know, he's right under you, scanning you, C4 at the top. Yep, that's what happens when you go against Pulse. A lot of comp people use him. I've never really used him. Obviously, he's got the UMP. Very good gun, and that's why he's at number nine. At number eight, we got Mute. Now, Mute, at times, he's really a must on the team. You know, he can go from just shutting drones down to shutting walls down, you know? It's like, you want to get your drone around there? Well, it got muted, and at the same time, it's like he's got the wall, you know, shut down. So, it's like, he's a two-way operator. Really good. I honestly... I think it almost should have him at number five, but not haven't really used him as much, so my list, my rule. Number seven, we got Ella, one of the better roamers in the game. Now look, you can't go wrong with the SMG or the shotgun. If you can manage that recoil on the SMG, go ahead. If you can't, you really can't go wrong with the shotgun. A great roamer to have. Another one of those operators where you just don't want to go against. Now number six, we got Legion, one of my favorite operators to use. You know, I could just go around throwing them ghoul mines. You know, you trying to get up that step. Oh, now I heard you. You know, it's really good to have him. I feel like it's really good to use Legion if you're ever doing like solo kills because, you, you know, you could just set up around you, throw your traps around. So if you don't got no calling out, you can have them hit the traps and, yeah, give your own call outs. At number five, we got Whammy. I'm pretty sure that's how you say his name. It's like another version of Jaeger, you know what I mean? can't go wrong with using him uh, he's got some really good guns you know I use the AUG only because I got black eyes but I like using him cool operator using you know this is the top five now this one to get serious so yeah and number four we got echo and you know if you didn't ban this guy you know he, he's gonna give you hell if you go against the comp echo he's gonna give you hell and that's all I gotta say he's gonna give you hell and number three we got doc you know the round starts, he spawn peeking you, he takes a couple licks, it's cool, he heals himself, and he's buried back in the action. Doc is the more comp version of Rook. I'd rather use Rook, but Doc is the more comp version. He got the ACOG MP5. Let's be honest, we don't got black ice for him. Number two, we got my favorite defender to use, Bandit. I mean, he's three speed, he's got the MP7. He's fast and he's a must with banded tricking and all that. You got to have him almost every single round. And number one, the best operator in the game, I got to give it to Jaeger. Now, yes, he's not a three speed anymore, which people argue, which doesn't make him the best operator anymore. But even as a two speed, I still feel like he's really fast. And I feel like he has the best gun on defense. He has the best gun and you can even argue the best ability. 
you know, you throw a grenade in there, you think you got an easy little thing going on, he shuts it right down and it's like nothing, you know. So, I got to say Jaeger's the best uh, defender in the game. And that's the list. That's all 28. If you like the video, man, like, sub, comment, fuck with your boy, man. And uh, I'm out.